Hey everybody, Aficionados Chris here for today's Chrysicism, and today's Chrysicism is brought to you by Acorn Media. I know I sound like a commercial, but it is the truth, because the entire Chrysicism is all Acorn Media products that they have sent me. Acorn Media has become one of my favorite companies to work for, because everything they make is just top-of-the-line quality, I enjoy everything they do, and they always just treat everything beautifully. They always do the best editions of everything so let's stop talking let's get into what they sent me first and foremost a very big product is available right now it is the blu-ray release of the original tinker taylor soldier spy with the great alec guinness playing george smiley now before you ask i have not seen the recent film adaptation with gary oldman so i can't make that comparison but uh, i can tell you what i thought of this version and i really enjoyed it i was very uh, enticed it grabbed me you know i was very intrigued it just held my attention the entire time i really loved watching it, it was very addicting and uh it's just it's a great story basically the the brief rundown is there is this uh service in england the british secret intelligence service and there's these four guys tinker taylor soldier spy of course there is a mole in this group and it's up to george smiley uh again it's up to George Smiley to figure out who it is because it's one of these four men. And uh, I really enjoyed it. Uh, I really recommend everyone check this out. In fact, I did not notice, but there's actually a brief appearance by Patrick Stewart. That threw me off when I saw him. I thought that was really cool. And uh, the big thing about this release is not only is it the first time this has ever been seen in high definition, and by the way, the picture quality looks perfect, but it's also got some brand new bonus features, which include exclusive interview with the director, some deleted scenes, an interview with the original author of the book, some production notes, a glossary of main characters and uh, terms, and a biography of the author. And I definitely recommend you guys pick this up. It's great, and if you saw the film adaptation, definitely try and check out the original version. I really liked it. I think a lot of people will like it, so pick it up. It's available right now. Next up, it's another British miniseries. Now, I've always been a big fan of period pieces. I don't know why, I just always have, but what caught my eye besides that is that this features one of my favorite actors of all time in one of his earliest roles. It is a Women of Substance, the trilogy, which is based on a series of books by the same name. And uh, this has a great list of actors, but the big one for me has to be Liam Neeson. And I love Liam Neeson. Now, this is before Liam Neeson was anything like he is now, you know, just this big uh, movie actor. So uh, if you really want to see Liam Neeson in his prime, check this out. And uh, an essential rundown of the premise is that this woman uh, right here, her name is Emma Hart. It's basically going through her life from servant girl to becoming this very big, important businesswoman. It's very long, but it is very intriguing, very interesting. I enjoyed watching it. I enjoyed watching it with my mother a lot because she's a big Liam Neeson fan as well. So this was a good watch. I really enjoyed it. It's not girly or anything. Men can enjoy this, especially people who really love Liam Neeson. And, and it even has Barry Bostwick from Rocky Horror Picture Show. That also threw me off. I thought that was really cool. So definitely check this out. It'll be available May 1st. The next two are a TV show from NBC. It's a show I never heard of, but I'm very glad I got to watch it because I was really blown away by this one. I thought this was a great idea for a series, and it is Who Do You Think You Are? Now, season one's already available right now, but season two will not be coming out. But season two will not be made available till May 1st. So definitely pick this up when it's available. And essentially, uh, the plot of this series is that all these celebrities, uh, people you would know, like in this season we got Rosie O'Donnell, and Steve Buscemi, and Gwyneth Paltrow. Uh, basically what it is is that these celebrities uh, find out their roots. Like they go and, you know, discover what their ancestors were like to basically figure out who they were in history. It's really, really cool. And uh, a lot of the... Uh, things that they learn are very, very surprising, if I can say. And, uh, bef you know, while we're on that, Season 1 uh, features actors Matthew Broderick, uh, Sarah Jessica Parker, Susan Sarandon, uh, Brooke Shields, and even Spike Lee. Spike Lee's is probably one of my favorite stories in this series. So definitely pick up both these seasons. They're very affordable, and they're really... Just, there, it's just something, and you've got to check this show out. It's I, I highly recommend it. And once again, this is available right now. This will not be made available till May 1st. So yeah, remember go to acornmedia.com and check them out. You can order their stuff there. Thank you so much for watching today's Chrysicism. I'm Vision Chris, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.